Welcome to the Lotus Goddess Divine Love. Hi everyone, how's everyone doing today? Hope you're doing well, staying safe. Welcome back everyone. Welcome if you're new to my channel. I do Divine Mask and Divine Feminine Twin Flame Journey Charm readings. And let's begin and just keep in mind that this is a general reading. Let's see what messages come through today. So in this reading, I see that there is a Divine Masculine who is finding the courage, the confidence, the motivation to move forward. But at the same time, there is this um, heaviness that pulls this Divine Masculine back. It feels, and what I see here is something about hesitation, hesitation about moving forward um, into the unknown. Uh, it's something that has to do with the change. So. This masculine is avoiding the change. I see here that there is a cycle that needs to come to close, but divine masculine, um, they should be moving a little bit uh, in a different direction, but they are being pulled back out of fear and out of, I feel like the unknown. The unknown is what is preventing this Divine Masculine from moving forward. It shows here not having uh, full strength to move in a direction which they cannot see. It's like, where does this path lead me to? Where is this path going to take me? Uh, this Divine Masculine feels a little bit lost when not having clear direction or sight of where they're going. This is um, something that... I feel came out of nowhere because this is some something the divine masculine has been working on. I see here working on their um on their happiness, so uh, internally working on self love, reflection, uh, wanting balance, wanting structure. They are taking the steps they need to to move forward, but at the same time they are pulling themselves back. It's like sabotaging their own happiness preventing themselves from moving forward because of fear and doubt of not seeing what is up ahead. This Divine Masculine, I feel like this is a thought pattern or something that has been repeating within the Divine Masculine's mind. It shows here that it's a repeating of something that is preventing Divine Masculine from moving forward. Masculine is trying to be strong uh, again something about the unknown is bringing about fears and doubts i'm not really sure if this is this is the right time or the right moment or the right path to be taking i feel that this masculine has the courage within them to do it but the fear is that sudden shift sudden doubt sudden fear uh, it shows something about unexpected, an ex unexpected reaction or feeling or emotion that this Divine Masculine is experiencing. It's like one moment they're like, I'm going for it. And the next moment's like, I don't know, is this, is this the right thing for me? There's also a lot having to do with working on things that are connected to the past. This Divine Masculine is thinking about his past relationships, connections, um, commitment. And they feel like the past is, it may be a little bit, it may be a little bit of a haunting. The memories of the past have been haunting this Masculine. They want to remove any kind of feelings or emotions attached to the past that can also prevent them from moving forward. But they recognize that, hey, I should I should let go of this feeling because it's, it's no longer here. 
I feel like the divine masculine recognizes that the emotion that they are feeling connected to memories of the past is not of the present. It's no longer here. That's of the past. So maybe I should let, let it go and leave it in the past. So this masculine has come to some kind of consciously, is, is consciously aware of what they're feeling at the time or in the moment. And they're recognizing that if they feel something that is different, when thinking about the past, that those emotions are not of the present, that they could be emotions that are connected to the past. This masculine wants to turn themselves away from anything of the past that may be holding them down from moving in, moving forward in the present because this divine masculine wants a change. I see here, they no longer want to be confused. They no longer want to wander around as if they are letting their life just um, take, its, take its own course. This Divine Masculine has recognized that some of the choices, decisions that they make can help guide them on the right path. And they do not want to be, it's like, I don't want to, to blindly go where, like it feels like this Divine Masculine allowed his life to just play out as it is not really recognizing that they also have some sort of say. They have willpower. They have the strength to make a change. And this Divine Masculine does not want history to repeat itself. It's like, I do not want to wander and just blindly go into one direction. I want to know where I'm going. And I feel like that might be one of the reasons why this Divine Masculine is having that fear of moving forward, as I mentioned before. Because they have that strength within them. They want to make a change. But at the same time, not having that clear vision of where they're going is making them feel like, hmm, maybe I am, maybe I am not, I'm not seeing what I need to see. Maybe I need to slow it down a bit. So this Divine Masculine is taking small steps, I feel, um, towards the direction, but just being uh, mindful of where they're going. It's like I want to make sure that the direction I'm going is the right direction. It's like just being careful of their next steps because I feel this divine masculine in the past has just wandered into the darkness, not really seeing clearly. And then when they saw the results of their actions, they re they recognized that maybe I should have paid more attention. Maybe I should have been more mindful, more alert, m more conscious. And um, this divine mas masculine does not want to, want history to repeat itself. So when they are guided to move into a certain direction, it's like that fear creeps in. And I feel like that fear creeps in because they don't want to experience what they have, have in the past. So they want to make a change. And that also means to make a change in how they pursue certain things, how they move into a certain direction, the, to the choices they make, the decisions they make. So moving on in this reading, I see here wanting to restore the connection uh, with loved ones, but they know that a lot has to do with if they are feeling some sort of heaviness or burden, something that has to do with their their. It shows here needing to clear out things that are within the divine masculine in order to be strong enough and and able to make a change to restore connection. They have some sort of baggage here in this reading. It shows here a heaviness that they are carrying. Um, but at the same time, they are not blaming themselves. It's like, I recognize that some of the choices that I made, I did it without thinking or I did it without consciously being aware of this choice or decision. They recognized that they were they were kind of like a different version of themselves. And now when they are starting to see things a little bit differently from a different perspective, it's like I don't want I don't want to feel this heaviness, but I know that I need to clear it out. They are aware that certain things need to clear out into in order to restore strength, balance, courage. And I see here restoring strength within their emotions because there is something having to do with Divine Masculine being very emotional, being stuck in their emotions and not really 
understanding why. But once this Divine Masculine clears out what they need to clear out, they will see what they are being guided to, to see. This masculine has a lot of emotions that they need to figure out. It shows here um, they've, they've closed some of their, what they feel. It's like closing off certain feelings, emotions that they felt. Um, it's like protecting their heart. I see here protecting the, their emotions. Um, even when they were guided in a certain way by the divine, um, to pursue a certain dream, this divine masculine put emotions, feelings aside. It's like, even if I really want this, even if I really desire this goal or this dream, I want to fulfill this, but I have to put my emotions aside because in the past, this divine masculine was guided a lot by emotions that they didn't really, it's like they worked off of impulse. So this is different from being intuitively guided. This divine masculine worked off of impulse. They had no clear direction. And because of the mistakes that were made, um, decisions that were made based off of quick impulse, this divine masculine has closed off that part when it comes to that emotion, that feeling. Uh, feeling that even if I have these feelings about something in particular, maybe I have to be careful or mindful of these emotions because I don't want to get stuck or I don't want to regret something. So I see here that they did close off a lot of their feelings, emotions, because they were really confused about what they were experiencing, what they were feeling. This Divine Masculine, um, when it comes to truth, this Divine Masculine is starting to recognize a lot about themselves. They are, it's like accepting responsibility, accepting truth about self, um, no longer making excuses for self. And this Divine Masculine is seeing the, it's like they're being realistic about what they see between you and them. So this Divine Masculine in this reading is seeing that to be with Divine Feminine, it's going to be difficult because there's a lot of things that I, meaning Divine Masculine, need to work on within myself. So that's one. And two, because this Divine Masculine knows that moving towards Divine Feminine requires a lot of not only confidence, strength, but responsibility taking the responsibility as the counterpart, taking responsibility in that role and taking responsibility to bring the connection, to restore the connection to what it was, but meaning that what it was, meaning the essence, the, the, the energy of it, right? So not in the physical, bringing to what it was. It's like reunion of the energy. And to, to take part in a way where this Divine Masculine is able to elevate the connection, to bring it into it, it's, it's like the ultimate, it's showing here the ultimate, the highest potential of the connection, bringing it to its fullest, to the abundance. So abundance in all aspects. I see here, wanting to bring bring in wish fulfillment, wanting to bring in the knowledge, the knowledge that is given by the divine. Not only restoring the connection, but restoring to what it was prior to, prior to coming into the 3D. So the union, the union of the energy. One more thing I see here is that this Divine Masculine, when it comes to reconnecting with the Divine Feminine, they will move towards Divine Feminine in a very, um, a very strong and determined manner. This follows once they have restored their faith, restored their faith in self, restored balance within self, so that that emotion, that energy is more of in balance, in tuned. And the divine is going to guide this divine masculine. But 
there are some some individuals that might try to come in the path of masculine when they are making their way towards divine feminine but this divine masculine is going to push that aside and continue to move forward so this is the reading for today i hope you like this reading if you like my readings please subscribe to my channel leave a comment below and thank you all for watching have a great day bye everyone